Hello class. Today you will see some pattern in squares. See, I have taken here some numbers: twenty-five square, thirty-five square, seventy-five square, one twenty-five square. What is common in all these numbers? Five. Twenty-five containing five as unit is here. In thirty-five, five is unit is here. Again, five unit is here. And in one twenty-five, five unit is here. Now we will discuss how to find the square of these type of number easily without any calculation. What you will do? Suppose twenty-five square. You have your twenty-five. Five is the unit, is it? Is five? Go up one side. Let me see. Now what you will take? Two. What you will take? Two. Then what you will do? Two. Multiplied by its successor means what consecutive number greater than it. So three, two into three, successor of two is three. So two into three, then multiply it by hundred plus twenty five. So what you will get two three just six hundred plus twenty five, six hundred twenty. Five. You can multiply twenty-five into twenty-five is six twenty-five. Then check thirty-five square. Five को अगर हम एक साइड छोड़ दें, three is the number. Then successor of three is four. What comes after three? Four. Three into four multiply by hundred. Plus twenty five, three into four twelve, twelve into hundred twelve hundred plus twenty five. So thirty five square will be twelve hundred twenty five. Then seventy five whole square. So five one side, it's seven seven multiply by successor of seven. What comes after seven? Eight seven into eight multiply again by hundred. Plus twenty five. It is common. Multiply hundred plus twenty five. Multiply by hundred plus twenty five. Multiply by hundred plus twenty five. So seven eight is up. Fifty six. Fifty six hundred plus twenty five. It is five thousand six hundred twenty five. Then one twenty five. Five one side. What is the number twelve? Successor of twelve is thirteen. So twelve into thirteen again same number. Multiply by hundred plus twenty five. So what twelve into thirteen is one fifty six. One fifty six into hundred. So it is one fifty six into hundred plus twenty five. So one five six two five fifteen thousand six hundred twenty five. And you can check by multiply one twenty five into one twenty five. So in this way you can do the longer calculation. Sometimes in your objective exam, it's like thirty-five square plus two twenty-five square plus uh, you can say three four five square. Then you can find it easily by doing this trick. So I give you some question in assignments. Try by this pattern. Okay, thank you.